This demo will show you the enterprise grade protection that Veritas offers for SaaS workloads. So why Veritas SaaS Backup? SaaS Backup is a cloud-based service which is accessible from any device through a single web UI. All you need is an internet connection. Being a cloud-based solution, the total cost of ownership is the license cost. There are no hidden costs and you receive secure, unlimited storage and unlimited data retention for as long as you pay for the service. This slide gives you an overview of what is covered and protected within Office 365. As you can see, we offer extensive protection of SharePoint in addition to Groups, Teams, Exchange and OneDrive. So now I'm going to walk you through a quick demonstration that will show you how to configure backups for Office 365 and also how to restore a file from backup. So prior to logging into the console, you will be required to set up a dedicated Office 365 account for the backups and assign it to the global administrator role. Access to the console is via email and a password, and you can also utilize single sign-on and associated multi-factor multi authentication processes. Once you've signed in, you'll be asked to set up a cloud connector. Configuration of the cloud connector is a simple three-step process. Firstly, select your SaaS workload, name the connector, and then log into the dedicated Office 365 account with the global admin credentials. You have the ability to set up as many connectors as you wish. You will then be asked to configure the first backup. This is the only backup you will have to manually configure. Subsequent backups are automatic and snapshots are taken up to six times a day. So we click into settings and configure connector. From this console, you can select what components you wish to back up, in addition to the accounts you wish to back up. There is the option to automatically add all new accounts to the backup, which means no manual configuration is needed when a new account is added. In addition, you have the ability to set retention periods on individual connectors. This allows you to customize and set retention daily, yearly, and monthly, according to your retention policy and data types. You are also entitled to unlimited retention with your license. The data is replicated and stored in two data centers in Copenhagen in Europe, resulting in four copies of your data. The data is encrypted at rest and in flight. In addition, the data centers are GDPR and security compliant. So the next part of this demo will show how items can be restored. For example, a document which was seen by a user four days ago. This example is applicable across all Office 365 components. So firstly, you click into your connector. You can then select a user. So you can select users by going into the user account or you have the option to use the search bar at the top. So if I type in Patty, as you can see here, it's brought up Patty Taylor. The search function also includes subfolder search, which allows you to search any number of levels on the cloud tenant, in addition to finding relevant results when search terms are misspelt or incomplete. So as you can see here, I've done a subfolder search for Patty. So if we click into Patty Taylor's environment, we are now in the user's current Office 365 environment and have the option to search for a historic snapshot by clicking onto history snapshots here. This is where you can select the point in time from which you want to restore the data or simply a, enter a date range at the top. As we are trying to find a file from four days ago, click into this snapshot here. We can now see the content of the user's environment from four days ago and access the document we are looking for by drilling down into the OneDrive folder. You have the option of previewing the file or email prior to restoration. For example, if you have emails with the same subject, this can help you quickly find the 
write data to the store. You can recover a cloud connector and individual users accounts all the way down to file level with multiple restore options for choice and convenience. This includes creating a secure password protected link. This will make the data available to anyone who receives the link. You can directly download the data onto the workstation. As you can see here, it's downloaded as a zip file and finally you can restore the data to its original location in Office 365. Restore to a different folder is also available for mail, calendar and OneDrive folders as you can see here and SharePoint sites or subsites can be restored to uh, restored as a new site with a new URL. This method does not overwrite data and gives you more control when restoring small amounts of data. One additional restore option is the ability to download Outlook folder or subfolders as a PST. This data format allows you to directly mount data back into Outlook using Outlook's import feature. Some extra features to mention are role-based access control, so if we create users, this means the global admin can assign users different roles with varying permissions. For example, the audit role allows a user to view the audit logs which record all activity within the console. The job monitor enables monitoring of backup and restore operations. And the audit logs enable monitoring of all users' actions within the console. The support icon opens the Verbtask support site and the notification bell provides notification on all actions within the environment and this can be synced with your email. If we go back into connectors, I can show you the deleted files function here. This allows you to view all the data that ever existed on a tenant and which was backed up by a solution. If we click onto the feature, all deleted files, folders will show as grayed out, as you can see. It allows you to easily find deleted users, folders or objects, all of which can be directly shared, downloaded or restored. This is the end of the demo and I want to thank you for watching. If you wish to find out more information on the solution, then please take a look at the SAS Backup webpage. In addition, there is a free 30-day Office 365 trial, which you can access using the following link. Any more information, please feel free to contact Veritas. Thank you for watching.